Okay, let's solve this problem. Um, this is the last problem for today's discussion. Atwoods na naman. <laughs> Hili ko talaga sa atwoods. <laughs> okay, and the atwoods machine shown at the right is initially at rest when the lower string is cut. The friction has fully has negligible mass. Use conservation of energy to find A, the speed of the objects when they are at the same height, and B, the acceleration of the system. I'll just show you the solution uh, uh, for this problem. Okay. Okay, so again, we have an atwoods machine that's shown at the right. So this particular initial configuration is our state one. Okay, so ang nangyari, state one, you have an Atwoods machine. I-draw I ko ha. Madal masadali kasi siya pag ni -redraw. So, you have an Atwoods machine initial at this position. MA, is, um, is the, the first mass is at this position. The second mass is some another position. Um, let's say, ganyan. This is MB. Tapos meron siyang lots niya nakahang. Tapos etong B, nakatali. Nakatali siya. Tapos yung distance between the height of MA and MB sub F. Okay? Gets? Gets pa to? Nakuha? Opo. Okay. Now, what I will, what will happen is if I cut this string, so I will get, syempre gagalaw yan. Pag cut yung string, si MA aangat, si MB bababa. Assuming na mas mabigat si, um, mas mabigat si MB kay MA. Otherwise, ang mga yare si MA naman yung bababa, si MB yung aakyat. It really depends on the on the on the masses MA and MB. For for the meantime, let's assume that MA is greater than MB. Para ang mga yare yung MA yung aangat, yung MB yung bababa. Okay. Now, what will happen there is this. So, so at the second state, the the system will be. So I have a pulley again. Now, what will happen is nasa equal position sila. Tapos. So let us say, ah, uh, dek, masyadong mataas. Baba ko ng konti, ganyan. So let us say, ito pa rin yung L. Ito still L. Kapag ito yung ground. Okay? Now, ang tanong ngayon, okay, what should be the height of the two masses after the, uh, when, they, uh, if when they are at the same height? Ano magiging value ng height sila? Ano tong value na to? So, excuse me. Di po ba ano dapat siya? MB is greater than MA po. Uh, again? Ah, oo nga. Sorry. Yeah, thank you for that. Oo nga. MB should be greater than MB. Oo nga, no? Tama, tama. If you want MB to go down, MB should be greater than MB. Thank you for that. Thank you for that correction. <laughs> Nabawasan yung mga ereratum ko. <laughs> thank you. Okay. So, going back, what should be this length here? This height here? Ano yan? Pwede mong isipin na ito zero. Diba? If I set this to be my y equals zero, and therefore this is at y equals L, what is the, um, at what position will these two masses be the, at the same height? Saan? E di syempre, aangat yun. Diba? Aakit yung isang the same quantity, above by isang, isang, isang quantity with the same quantity. Then, at same height sila if this is L over 2. Ama? Diba? Gets? L over 2 yan. Magsabihin, bumaba yung mass B ng L over 2, umakyat yung mass A ng L over 2 then. Okay. At lubat na ako. <laughs> Sorry for that. Um, okay. Ayun. Okay. Kala ko hindi charge. Okay. Now. Now, we have two masses, MA and MB. The system that we are considering is the system MA and MB and the pulley. The pulley doesn't care. We don't care about much about the pulley. Uh, Di naman yan gumagalaw. So, uh, kahit idagdag mo si pulley sa equations, magka-cancel out lang yan kasi wala namang velocity tapos hindi naman nagbago yung position niya. Therefore, we don't care much about the pulley. Now, okay. We will assume that the, the acceleration is constant. Hindi pa natin alam yan kung anong value ng acceleration na yan. Of course, alam natin by, by hindsight. Pero ang assum assumption natin is constant yung acceleration kasi hindi na tao tamang yung stream. So we can say that the acceleration is some constant. Okay. Now, if the acceleration is constant and the time is constant, syempre same naman yung time ng pagpunta niya sa same position, di ba? Time is also constant. Then, we can say that the velocity is also constant, di ba? The final velocity is constant. Therefore, the final velocity at the mass of the, at the first mass is equal to the final velocity at the second mass. Pares lang dapat ng, oh, sorry, pares sila ng speed, not necessarily the velocity. 
final speed. Kasi yung isa upward, yung isa downward. Okay? Magkaiba sila ng velocity. Magkakapare sila ng speed. Okay. Now, E1 equals E2. So, the initial state, you have a uh, mass MA. I will set my y equals 0 at the position of MA. Therefore, wala nang lalabas na initial potential energy ang MA. Pero, meron din mo siyang initial kinetic energy. Remember, they're both at rest so, bago ko pinutol yung stream. Therefore, um, wala nang initial potential energy. So, if I set, if I write MA, um, GYA, this is 0, plus 1 half MA, V, um, 1a, the initial velocity of a squared, this is also zero, therefore the second term is also zero, plus mb gyb plus one half mb g, I'm sorry, one of m v1b squared, this is also zero because again, the two masses are at rest, but yb here is equal to um to l, okay? This is just equal to ma g um, y um, but y a so this should be y one a and this should be y one b. Okay, this is y two a. The 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 state uh, the vertical position of a at state two plus one half m a v two a squared plus one half plus m g y two b plus one half m b v two b squared. So ang mangyayari is um. Both y1, uh, both um, y2a and y2b will be the same. So y2a equals y2b, which is just equal to what? Uh, again, ang nangyari sa end ng position nila is L over 2. Diba? So this is L over 2. Tapos, um, since the acceleration is constant, the time is constant, then v2a, speed naman kasi to, equals v2b, which is just equal to some final velocity. Diba? Okay? So, um, by doing so, combining these two equations and this equation, let's say this is equation one, we have a one half MA, um, uh, sorry, 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 sorry. This implies MG, sorry, this should be MBGL equals MA GL over two plus one half quantity MA plus MB V final squared plus MA MBG. L over 2. Tama? Tama? Yes. Tama? Tama. Ngayon, ilipat ko tong dalawang to. Ilipat ko tong dalawang to kasi parehas silang may G tsaka may N. So, and I'll get something like uh, an L over 2, a GL over 2, quantity, MB is positive, mas malaki to dito. So, magkakaroon ako ng kalahate. So, I have an MB. Pero itong MA, pag dilipat ko sa kabila, magiging negative yan, minus MB. Equals 1 half quantity MA plus MB quantity V final squared. Okay. And then the half, the one half will cancel and say that, okay, hence the final velocity is just equal to square root of MB minus MA all over MB plus MA. Uh, the square root quantity G L in a square root. That is the final answer. Okay. That's the first part. That's the final velocity of the of the system at the at the middle. Ngayon, kung equal yung masses ng dalawa yan, anong mangyayari? If M A equals M B, what will happen? What will happen? Siyempre, yung final velocity mamatay. Which should make sense because kapag equal yung masses niyan, pag equal din yung height nila, walang, hindi yan gagalaw. <laughs> hindi gagalaw yung Atmos machine. Okay? Now, what can I say about the acceleration now? So, uh, so what about E? What about the acceleration? So, ang gagawin ko, medyo may trick. Medyo madugas gagawin ko. Remember your kinematic equations. Kasi remember, acceleration is constant. Particles naman yan eh. So, your BF, BF squared equals VI squared plus 2G quantity Y, my Y final minus Y initial. This, this is true. Pero the initial velocity is zero. Tapos, ang mangyayari sa akin ay, yung displacement ko dito ay L over 2, and I get, I get something like A, I'm sorry, di pala 2G, it should be A. 
So this is 2A quantity L over 2. And this is simply AL. Tapos, thus VF equals the square root of the acceleration times length. Pero this is also equal to this one. Hence, ano mangyayari dyan? So this is equal to quantity MB minus MA all over MB plus MA quantity G times L. By comparing the two, ano makakuha kong acceleration there? What is my acceleration? My acceleration is simply G quantity MB minus MA all over MB plus MA. This is also the same acceleration for an active machine. Diba? Gets ba? Nakuha? Opo. Okay. So yun, yun yung um, topic for it's the same acceleration that you'll get. Pero instead of using forces, I used energies in deriving the acceleration of an atmosphere machine. Okay? Nakuha? Do you get this item? Nakuha to? Nakuha yung solution ito? Get ba? Yes, po. Again, kaya L over 2 to kasi you started with 0, go to L over 2. You started with L, you go to L over 2. Kaya L over 2 yung displacement. Okay? Get? Okay. 